what is up you sexy beasts it is 23.3 redo day re-attempt day and uh i'm just here getting ready all my toys <laughs> got my little heel inserts just to uh just to get a bit more help on the old snatchies and uh if you watch my first attempt you'd know that my shoulder is a bit tender so i thought Come on, old man, pop a couple of nerofins and uh, hopefully they will just help take the edge off. Fit aid, energy, of course. I got the uh, kinks out of my RX Smart Gear Evo 3, so uh, I'm gonna use that today. That's my number one rope. And uh, I might pop the air wave in today and just um, have something to kind of bite against when I, um, yeah, when I'm snatching, but also when I'm like, try my absolute hardest to get a uh, handstand push-up out so we'll see we'll see if all of this amounts to at least hopefully just one strict handstand push-up let's go all right team i just got two strict handstand push-ups in the warm-up massive thank you to uh coach theo for opening the gym on a sunday and letting me do this make sure you go subscribe to theo this is handle right here uh subscribe i mean go follow him he's actually a legit content creator so worth a follow okay hopefully I can get at least one out under fatigue let's do it let's do it and he's off and uh, what I'm gonna do for this video I'm gonna pop my first attempt in the bottom corner because you're not going to believe it. My split time here was a whole minute ahead of my first attempt, and I want to see how this how this happened. The wall walks were definitely better, um, especially on the way back. One, two. You'll see I just do two steps, and I'm there. On the way up was still a bit awkward, but watch me on the way back. I go one, two. I'm there. So uh, I figured that out. So that was a lot faster, I think. And then I did not trip up on these like I did in my first attempt. I'm pretty sure I go 50 unbroken here. Confidence was so high, I guess, going into this knowing that I managed to get one strict handstand push-up out in a warm-up. I was like, I'm sure I am sure I can get another one. And so, uh, yeah, I was very eager to get there and, and give myself lots of time. Now, I'm giving you this commentary without seeing the comparison with the first one. So, unfortunately, I can't comment on how I'm, how I'm going against my previous attempt, but you can obviously see that on the screen now. Again, I was very intentional here about not moving my feet, just going straight down, straight up, not passing to the hip. So just a straight line up, straight line down. And today, instead of doing five, 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 I open up a set of 10. So I assume that bought me a fair bit of time and then I finished off with five more here. I really like this approach, just straight line up, straight line down. It's light enough to just muscle it like that with a slight knee bend on the catch. One more here. 15 done. So on the handstand walk, so I just made sure that I didn't get any no reps. I kind of was really intentional about getting both feet up before I moved my hands and then just focused on just tapping and going essentially on the wall. So you'll see as soon as my back hand, my second hand touched the line, bang, straight back out. Yeah, and coming back down, just having, I think two or three steps. I think it was only two steps for me on the way back really helps so one two three i guess <laughs> i think i did those little resting with the arms out to the side i did that on most reps on the uh, first attempt first attempt so today i only did that once which is good okay moving on to the 61 kg bar that's the other thing, I guess. Oh, no, sorry. Double unders. I actually thought I was on the bar, but I uh, forgot about the dubbies. Now, you won't believe it. He gets to 49 and then trips up and does a quick single at the end. Um, yeah, so the weights were heavier today as well because my first attempt I did with uh, slightly lighter weights. 
just because I didn't have the appropriate um, incremental plates at home. This is something about doing the open workouts at an actual gym, an actual CrossFit affiliate with a coach or with a, a judge. It's just, there's something about it. It's just good. Now, I forgot to tape my thumbs and I also forgot to put the airwave in my mouth. So um, luckily there's some chalk bucket right there. And we'll just go for the 12 singles here. Just making sure that every single rep counts and just staying over the bar. So not walking backwards, dropping the bar, staying over it and going straight back down. I guess knowing that my only goal is to get one handstand push up out. You don't have to pace this. You just kind of go as fast as you can and get it done. I had an extensive, extensive warm up today. I took a lot more time to warm the shoulders up and honestly, it's just made a world of difference. Um, yeah, I think my movement just looks a lot better today than it did in the garage the other day, rushing into it. So who would have thought, eh? Warm ups, they help. They, uh, they do do the trick. <laughs> what are we here? Four minutes and 30 seconds. I'm pretty sure I get this done under five minutes. And I actually finish with a double and almost misses it. I always miss the 12th rep. Here we go. Zinga. Saves it. Done at 4.46. How quick is that? That's so much quicker than my last attempt. All the time in the world. And yeah, it's a pretty long rest here. I just, like I said, my goal is to get one strict handstand push up. And so I just rest for a very long time here. So uh, feel free to fast force a little bit. I want to say it's a good, a good 30 seconds to a minute here. There's a few different options for mats. There was a firmer, a firmer mat, and then there was like the spongy gymnastic one that I've got there. It's I don't know why, but I just felt so much more comfortable on the spongy soft one. So ended up using that. Here he goes. First attempt. Can he get it? Uh, funnily enough, my, it's my right arm there, which is not the sore one. The left one's a sore one. The right one didn't keep up, and I fell over. Lost my balance. Okay, so that's one attempt. No good. Here we go. Attempt number two. Came away from the wall, so even though I pressed out, my feet came off the wall, no rep, baby. Two attempts, no reps yet. At this stage, I'm panicking because I'm like, you know what, I've done two reps here, essentially. I've extended my elbows pretty much, but they haven't counted, and now I feel like I've wasted all my energy, so I was definitely panicking a little bit here. But finally, he brings it together. And looking at that rep, man, that looked fairly fast. Like, that wasn't a struggle. I don't know what I did there that was different, but that looked pretty comfortable. That's one. Still got a whole two minutes. Can he get more? Nah. This will definitely be a movement that I'll be working on loads over the next 12 months. I'm not a big fan of kipping handstand push-ups anymore. I don't do any of them, to be honest, but I feel like strictees is definitely something that I can work on. And um, yeah, you know, you don't need the amount of volume that you could do on, on kipping ones. And it can be a bit more controlled, so you don't kind of come down your neck too much. I just feel like there's no need for me to be, I can, I can strengthen my shoulders in other ways, you know? Um, but I like the idea of being able to pump out a set of 10 of these and 
and not stress about it. So I'll definitely be working on these over the next 12 months. What's he got here? He's got 40 seconds left and he's got one in the bank. And he gets a second one. Two reps in. The goal was one. He's got two in the bank. And there's time for one last attempt. Just focus on the workout, buddy. <laughs> Get up, bro. And he gets a third. Unbelievable. If I can get one at the end of the workout, sure, I could have got those first two. But uh, hey, I'm very happy. Three reps on the handstand push-ups. I am proud and happy. So that is my open done and dusted. How good. Got a way faster split time. How is that even possible? Like over a minute faster. I, uh, I went way faster in the wall walks. Just I remember how to do them now. And uh, went 10 and 5 on the lightweight. Singles on the 61, and then fail two, got three. Really happy with that. Really, really happy. Thanks, Theo. Yes, I kept my shirt on. What is that? Wow, are you even a cross-sitter? You know, kept my shirt on the whole time. 